doctors, you have five minutes to places, five minutes to places. Sound, go. Lights, go. Spot two, go. Ready to go in three, two, one. Lisa Clarkson and I'm directing three of the concerts in this summer's festival up in the Poconos. The first is the Salute to Cole Porter. The second one is the Great American Songbook. And we're also doing the reading of a brand new play musical called The Lost Girl. For most of our concerts, we'll have one day of going over the music for the first time and learning harmonies. We'll have about two days of staging. We'll bring all the artists from New York to the Poconos. We'll have a couple hours to rehearse and then it's showtime. Today is the first rehearsal for putting the singers and the orchestra together for our Cole Porter concert at the Buck Hill Sky Top Music Festival. I fell in love with Cole Porter during my Broadway debut, Doing Anything Goes, and I wanted to do this concert because uh, it was full of incredible people. Joey Chansey brought me on board and told me who was going to be in it, and it's just a pretty amazing group of people. Well, right now the actors just arrived to do a full run of the show. It'll kind of be a rough through. We have four hours to go through a two-hour show. Um, so the goal is to s go through without any stops, but we're trying to do things in real time. I think the, the thing that will be most thrilling is seeing all the pieces come together finally. So I can't wait to see it come together. I think after a year of really hard work with a lot of really great people and volunteers, I think the most important thing tonight is the community coming together and meeting lots of new people. Uh, today is a big day for us. We are the writers of The Lost Girl, and this is the first time we're hearing the piece with the full band and cast, and we couldn't be more excited. Today is actually our second day of load-in and tech. The actors were here yesterday and we did a dry tech and today is our final day to put the costumes in and have a costume run before we open. This experience will help me in my future because I get to work with professionals. I'm not at a theater camp with a bunch of other kids my age. I'm with adults who do this for a profession, so it's really cool. What's been so fantastic for us about working with Buck Hill Sky Top Music Festival is the opportunity it gives us to take this piece where it is, uh, uh, fix it, change things, see how everything works with actors on a stage. And that is such a gift to writers. And we are so grateful to Buck Hill Sky Top Music Festival for making that possible for us. The American Songbook is the final concert of the music festival. Today was our final Sits Pro for the Great American Songbook concert, which features pop music from the past hundred years. Uh, I think a concert like this is important to see because it really does show you the vast uh, different styles that you know, music has come from. We're doing something really cool by blending pop music of today and using uh, different orchestrations and making it a full sound. Today we're at the Sky Top Lodge bringing in our final concert for this season 2015. The orchestra is in there rehearsing with the singers. It's going to be a pop concert out in the garden area. It's something for everybody and it's just great. Can't wait to see it.
am ready to go out there and take the stage with a bunch of talented musicians and kids and, and instrumentalists and let's do it. no limit to what we can think of and what we can bring to the area. It's been just a great concert. We're looking forward to seeing Buck Hill Sky Top Music Festival see a future that is a musical destination for audience members and artists alike.